Republican congressional candidate Marilinda Garcia has taken the unusual, though legal, step of paying herself a salary from her own campaign. In her amended campaign finance report, which came online late yesterday, Garcia was paid $3,335.15 on September 30th. The expense was listed as payroll, as it is for other employees on her campaign. The amount she was paid was a few more dollars than her campaign, re campaign manager receives in his monthly salary. The Garcia campaign confirmed the payment was for salary, given that she is now campaigning full time. Garcia has been a candidate for 11 months, but this was the first paycheck. She currently doesn't have another full time job. Garcia is facing Democratic incumbent Annie Custer in the state's competitive second congressional district race. According to public records, Custer and her husband are worth around $1.8 million, and she currently earns a congressional salary as taxpayer money of $174,000. Now, under the McCain-Feingold campaign finance law, candidates for federal office are allowed to pay themselves. This is with the theory that allows regular people to run for office, not just the rich who can afford to take a year off the campaign. That said, she is the first New Hampshire candidate for major office in recent years to pay herself, and this move could hurt her standing with political donors in the backstretch here. For WMUR News 9, I'm James Pendle.